Hey guys, Gav here. This time uh, I'm going to have somewhat of a different style video just because I'm not going over Minecraft but rather MC Edit or Minecraft Edit which is a world editing program that you can use to quickly make things that are uh, much more complex or much more time intensive than you would normally be able to do. So for instance if you wanted to uh, open up a massive space or build something and then mirror it so you only had to build half of what you originally wanted to, this is the program to do it. So let's open up something and I'll uh, fool around with it and show you how to use it. This tutorial will really only go over the super basics of it. Uh, basically movement, which is actually a little more complex than uh, you would first anticipate it being. So as you can see, I'm loaded up into some world I downloaded. I've been fooling around with it uh, just a little bit. But I'm moving around here and... Uh, the way this world works is it will load in chunks. Uh, the same sort of chunks that load when you're moving around, only this one does it slightly slower. So movement in this uh, MC Edit program is fairly simple, somewhat intuitive, but at the same time there are a few little differences that you need to learn. So I'm moving around right now using the WASD keys, uh, W forward, S back, a left, D right, you know, that's all the same. There are also two other keys which allow you to control vertical pitch. Uh, the Q key will cause you to go up and the Z key will cause you to go down. There are also two modes uh, in which to view something. There is um, the mode that I'm doing here which is really like a free moving around view. Uh, you can sort of control whatever. There's also another type uh, which is easily accessed by clicking the right mouse key. And this allows you to select blocks a little bit more easily. Uh, you can untoggle this by, again, clicking the right mouse key and it'll get you out of it. Uh, sometimes the program will lock up a bit and it'll be tough to switch in between these two views and it'll revert to this. If that happens, literally just hold down the right mouse uh, key and just move around. So that's the quick and easy way to move around. I'll be having an entire series of these just so you can learn how to use the entire program but without having to watch say a 10 minute video. But thanks for watching guys.